Hey, this is Left Technical, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a nice icon for your application. So, I'm going to get the icon plugin for Photoshop. I'm going to Google icon plugin and go to the first link. And this is the icon plugin that you want. It will create these mipmap like images for your icon and so that the um, icon can be displayed nicely at several different resolutions. So I'm going to extract this icon to um, Programs Files, Adobe, Adobe Photoshop, Plugins, File Formats. And then I'm going to extract it to that directory. And then you want to restart Adobe Photoshop if you already have it open. Alright, so let's make an icon. Since um, I'm using a Windows XP operating system and I'm not going to be developing this app for Windows Vista or Windows 7, I'm going to start off at 48 pixels by 48 pixels. This is the largest the icon will be displayed at. In Windows Vista and Windows 7, the icons can be displayed at like 128 and maybe, maybe even higher. So I'm just going to make this background transparent and draw some random shit in there Alright, that's a masterpiece. So we're going to go to File, Save As. I'm going to save it under My Pictures uh, as an icon, and I'm going to call it App Icon. Alright, so I'm going to save it as a 32 bit pixel icon, and that checks out. And then we're going to go to Image, Image Size. 32. I'm going to resize it and I'm going to save it again. I'm going to save it as the same thing. Overwrite. Select 48 by 48. So we're adding this sub icon to the file. I'm not sure how this works, but this is how I made it um, work. It's kind of tedious. Sorry, forgot to resize. If you know of a better, more proper way of doing this, then please say something. The next resolution down that these icons are displayed at is 24 by 24. And then I'm going to save it again. Icon. Go to the sub icons and select both of them. And then going to resize it down to 16 which should be the smallest resolution it will be displayed at all right save it again all right so now we have four different sub icons and that should just about do it so we're going to go to our windows forms application and we're going to add our icon to it. We called it App Icon. So it looks pretty nice on the form. Now let's add it to our manifest. Alright, we're going to go to Icon and Manifest and go to this. Sweet. Alright, build the project. And we're going to go to the debug folder and it looks nice nice smooth and we're gonna view it in a bunch of different resolutions go to thumbnails 48 by 48 looks nice we're gonna go to the lists 16 by 16 looks nice alright so if you didn't use sub icons the operating system or whatever is just gonna be sizing it for you and it's gonna look pixely 
you want Photoshop to do the sizing. Alright, so that should just about do it. This is Left Tactical signing out.